Well, they well, admit well, there's all sorts of uh, ionizing towers that can, mani uh, can manipulate the weather. That's mainstream news now. Uh, so much of this stuff that was science fiction is now admitted that it's been going on uh, behind the scenes, Andrew. Ours is mini harp, by the way. They're starting to test that out using this. Uh, the well, I've talked to a guy that works at a University of Texas research facility, and that's all I'm allowed to say. Well, actually, he's called in before. I've known him personally for 12 years. His first name's Steve, and I'll just leave it at that. In fact, Steve, if you could ever get me a note, I'd like to have you on as a guest without saying your last name. But he has witnessed, um, he says that the Doppler radar facilities, many of them are a cover, just like they have a camp within a camp at Camp X-Ray. They'll have a real Doppler radar system, and then right next to it, they'll have another array that they claim is under federal control that he claims is a harp antenna to manipulate weather. And um, I remember him telling me this 10 years ago, and he gave me a lot of good info, but I'd still kind of roll my eyes. Now, the exact arrays he was trying to show me diagrams of or what are in the Daily Mail with uh, Dubai saying they can control the weather looks just like them. And uh, it's just, I can't handle it anymore. I mean, we're living in total crazy land.